Hello everyone, this is your boy Venomy here. I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. In today's video, I am back with another Forza Horizon 5 drift video. Today I have got a drift tune for the S15. A 1 million score guaranteed drift tune every single time you go up and down this mountain. But before we start, if you are new around here and like what you see, then please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But now let's jump straight into this. Okay, now this tune is definitely not for a beginner drifter. You're gonna have to have some experience before you try this tune, but when you do try it, I promise you it is good fun. Now, to start off with the engine swap, we're putting in the Racing 3 liter L60 engine. This thing is pushing over 1200 horsepower, so very, very powerful drift car. We are keeping it rear wheel drive and avoid the body kit. The body kit just, it doesn't look right at all, so don't go with the body kit. The tires and rims, we're going with drift compound tires. Make the front tire width as big as possible. Now the rear tire width, it's up to you. I've gone with stock, but if you want more grip, then go for the bigger set of tires. Now, for the engine upgrades, you just want to max every single one of these out, put them all onto race, just to get as much power out of the car as physically possible. And when you've done all of that, we can move over to platform and handling. Now, for platform and handling, race brakes, uh, drift springs and dampers, front and rear race anti-roll bars. You want to go with the race weight reduction kit as well. And of course, because it's a drift car, we are definitely going with that roll cage just to put a little bit of weight on the rear, the rear tires there just to help us. Now for drivetrain, race clutch, race transmission, race driveline, and once again, a drift differential. When you've done all of that, purchase all of those upgrades, and then we can start on the tuning. Now, I'll show all of you guys the share code and the actual tuning, but I want to start with the actual setup first, just for everybody that actually wants to see the setup and try tweak it or mess with it or make it better or adjust it to their personal preference. But just pause the video every time I change category, copy it all down, write it all down. You're going to have some great, great fun with this tune, but definitely warm up. A little bit first or if you are a beginner then practice a little bit more before you try this 1200 brake horsepower tune it is a monster it is 1 million score guaranteed every single run the angles it gets the amount of points it racks up it's just insane now I know some people argue you could probably get even more points with drag tires but I don't like the way the car, the car slides with drag tires, I absolutely hate it, I prefer the drift compound tires. For everyone, different subject, for everyone that wants a share code, it is on your screen right now. Using the share code will skip the tuning setup and the upgrades, it does it all for you, you just pay for everything. But the downside is you can't actually mess with the upgrades or the tune or anything like that. So you can't tweak it. You're kind of stuck with what you've got. But when it comes to this actual tune, for experienced drifters, they are going to absolutely love this tune. It's got the power to pretty much tackle any corner. And being an S15, the body kits, the actual parts on the car that you can actually have. I didn't talk about this on the upgrades, but the aero and appearance. Don't worry about any of that. Just give your car a nice body kit. Definitely treat that car. That's the thing I like about drift cars. And when it comes to dragon, obviously you don't want a spoiler or anything like that. You want to shed the weight and everything like that. Well, when it comes to a drift car though, you at least want your drift car to look good. So definitely treat your car to a nice, a nice body kit. Don't go with the ugly body kit that I showed you guys in the beginning of this video. It adds way too much weight and it just makes the S15 look horrible. But how I've got mine right now is looking absolutely gorgeous and it's 1 million score guaranteed at the minimum 
every time I go up and down the mountain. Obviously, if you're really, really good and want to risk some of the corners and go faster, then yeah, you are going to be pushing way over 1 million. I'd say about 1.1 million, you'd probably get the most out of this tune, maybe 1.2, something like that. I know some Toyota Supras, there was a record of 1.5 million but for this S15 without drag tires, not all wheel drive, drift tires with rear wheel drive, it's it's a point magnet, it is definitely a tune to try. But let me know what you think of the tune and the car down in the comment section below. I'll leave you all to enjoy the rest of the gameplay. I love every single one of you and I'll see you all in the next video.